what's going on youtube so this video is going to be pretty straightforward like most of mine and um it's basically just a video about how to make a t-shirt mock-up template so you can display your designs and you can even put out designs before having to even waste any material or anything the key is to keep it a bit simple and um yeah i hope you guys enjoy the video and i i hope it helps out in some type of way. So right here, all I did was use this green uh, tablecloth. It's like probably like a dollar or something, a Dollar Tree. I'm not sure where my wife got it for me from. But um, yeah, I just laid it down flat on the floor as good as I can and then I use two all style 1301 t-shirts one black one white you can do this with any color that you want uh, I just chose these because it's a lot more simple to use um, black and white t-shirts because if you get more of different colors the more colors you have the more sizes there is so you gotta always keep in mind that you know if you want to have 20 different colors you gotta have size extra small through three or four XL or whatever, and that gets really costly. So now I'm going to put this into Procreate. And one of my latest videos shows you on how to extract backgrounds. So this is what I'm doing right here. I'm removing the background of the green. That's the whole point of me using the green sheet is just to have one solid color so it's easier to remove the background from it. So now that I've removed it, I'm just going to do some tampering with the with t-shirt. The so there's a few different ways you can do this. How I like to do it is I go to the top left corner in the settings and go to adjustments click on layer and I adjust the the saturation and brightness of the shirt and that way I can get it best to the to the best color you know and I'm just gonna try to make it as realistic as possible and I just save that image and I do the same thing with the white t-shirt so let me just set this up real quick gonna take the background off make it a transparent image by deleting the background and the layers and now I'm going to import an image to show you what it looks like and I haven't adjusted the brightness or saturation on the t-shirt I'm uh, about to show it to you right now let me just size it real quick and this is about how the average t-shirt would look and now I'm gonna go back to the layer of the t-shirt. I'm gonna do the same thing I did with the other one and adjust it to make it look as good as I can. So here we go. And that's looking a lot better. Now I'm going to show you an example of how I put backgrounds behind this to make it more attractive. And what I do is I find commercial free images from Flickr and other websites like that. Or you can always even use your own images, which is probably the best. And um, just find, you know, a, a nice scenery or even a wooden table that you have at home, which is what I do for a lot of my mockups. And you see, I just like to upload my image. I haven't actually done the shirt like this but um i plan to maybe dtg or i'll get some super color transfers maybe so yeah this is basically the way the easiest way for me to do mock-ups you can always pay for a service to to do them for you and they have their own little models or anything but um this is just how i do it and also you can see, I'm gonna show you my website and this is how I do them. And you can order from me or you can add me on IG if you wanna see how the shirts look that are actually on the shirt. Um, 
they pretty much look exactly the same. So thank you for watching. I hope this helped and I'll try my hardest to find more time to upload more videos.